good claimant. Once more, I name myself Gur Fulur, High Luminary to my people, and chosen Elector of the Dawn Servant. You are much bigger than the others in the village. All your queen were once my equal in size. But ever since we were decimated by disease, it is rare to see a child reach our former stature. You speak of the contagion which afflicted the Shakhtural expedition, the one recorded in your murals. It is a chapter of our history that is entangled with the legend of the Golden City. I've heard that legend originated with the Yokhui. Is this true? With the visions our ancestors had, to be precise. Preceding the campaign into Shakhtural, many were visited by dreams of glittering splendor. They described a paradise that knew neither war nor famine, where people lived lives of eternal happiness. A single dreamer might have been dismissed, but when dozens, if not hundreds, spoke the same, the luminaries became convinced it was divine revelation. Expedition. Its purpose was to find a city of gold. Yes, help was marshaled from all the territories under our control. Lands were scoured on a massive scale. Ah, little wonder the legend is so similar across Tural. Those involved with the search would have passed the stories down to their children. Another claimant, I see. I will test your worth, as I have tested those who came before you. Here and now, I think he means. to the summit, though mayhap not whilst being hounded by Bakul Jaja and his minions. 
again that swine shows his disdain for the right. Strangely, despite his eagerness to antagonize us, he withdrew as soon as we fought back in earnest. I cannot fathom what he was trying to achieve. On a similar note, I'm also curious as to why you chose the peak of War Corps Zormor for the conclusion of this feat. The earlier stages saw us learn the history of the Yokui. Does this location also hold some special meaning for your people? Yes. It is a place of great significance. All these monuments? Is this a burial ground? Every high luminary before me is enshrined in this earth. Alongside them are the heroes who bravely stood their ground when Vali Armanda brought ruin to Urkopacha eight decades past. That explains why there are so many. Zorolja, I should have known you'd arrive here first. <sighs> ah, third promise. How relieved I am to find you in good health. Sarelcha, you bastard! I should end you here and now! Remember where you are. You will mind your conduct or you will leave. Right. I see no reason to delay further. Show me my father's sepulchre. Papa has a grave? who sealed away the monstrous Valley Garbanda, your fathers included. Gulul Chaja, Master of Resolve and Reason, Champion of Peace. Look at this one, Ketanram, Navigator of Uncharted Oceans. Ketanram? The Lamintan Explorer? Does this mean he joined Galul Jaja on his travels? Kafkiwa, Seeker of the Unknown. How strange to see your name here. It was unheard of to build leaving sepulchers for those who were not Yokui. But their great deed demanded recognition. Master of resolve and reason? Champion of peace? Papa really did some amazing things. He carved his path with martial skill. Yet it was clever thinking which allowed him to trap Valigarmanda within its own ice magics. Martial skill and clever thinking. Hmm. I can't compete with Zorolja's mastery of the Head of Resolve's techniques. And when it comes to knowledge, Kona's the one who most takes after the Head of Reason. Is there anything that I've gotten from Papa? Something I do better than the others. Of 
Of course. Papa's love for peace, for his people. That is what he's given me. And I'm fighting to preserve the peaceful Tural he built. else was that? You must return to Warlar's Echo immediately. Valigar Manda has broken free. I presume that was about the unholy sound? Valigar Manda is free? We need to get back there, now! <laughs> How fortuitous. We have been gifted an opportunity to outpace our rivals. <laughs> <laughs> 